Yes, good morning. Before we start our class this morning, let me all stand. Let's pray. Angel of God, my guardian dear, the home that love commits me here. Every day be at my side to light and guard, to rule and guide. Amen. Okay, you may sit down. Okay, for now, let me check your attendance. What's absent for today? Oh, Angelica Reyes is not around. Also, Maria Gonzalez. Okay, and Melvin Santos. Oh, the three of them are absent for the base class. See so now, before I'm going to conduct our lesson this morning, I am going to read a dialogue. Kindly listen very carefully because I am going to ask you a question. So here's the dialogue between the student and the teacher. Jason, excuse me ma'am, good morning, can I talk to you? Mrs. Nunes, tell me what do you need? Jason, I'm having trouble understanding the operation of division, which explained the last class of mathematics. Mrs. Nunes, that's probably because you get distracted in class. Sit down, we'll go over together because you have to prepare for the exam. Jason, thank you very much ma'am. So who can guess what is the dialogue all about? Very good. It is all about courtesy. And courteous means being polite. So what did J Jason say to Mrs. Muniz? Very good. Yes. What can you say about him? Is he a courteous boy? Yes, very good. So listen very carefully. Thank you. So now, we're going to review our lesson or our topic last time. So what is it? Who can answer? Yes, Anthony. It is all about addition. And now we will go in to what? To open up our new topic, which is subtraction. So subtracting tens and ones with regrouping. So before that, I'm going to have or I'm going to show you a flashcards and you're going to answer the basic subtraction. Okay? Okay, now, what is the answer of 18 minus 7? It's 11. Very good. How about 39 minus 6? 33. Very good. How about 20 minus 3? Oh, yes. It's 17. How about the last one is 19 minus 13 equals 6. Very good children. So now you already know how to subtract a basic subtraction. We will go in to conduct our lesson already, which is subtraction. So here I'm going to give you two um, problems and we will go into solve that one. First is 45 minus 17. Okay, can you subtract 5 from 7? Anyone? Can you subtract 7 from 5? Okay. Yes. It's what? It's a yes because 5 will go into borrow from 4. So 4 becomes 3. And 5 becomes 15. Very good, God. And then 15 minus 7. What is the answer? Yes, eight. Very good, children. Amazing. And now, four becomes three because five borrowed from four. So three minus one is two. Very good. So now, 45 minus 17 is 28. Very good, children. You already know how to subtract. Next is 17 minus. 56. We'll do the same. 
from letter A to letter B. So can you subtract um, 6 from 0? Yes, of course you can. 0 will borrow from number 7. 0 will become 10. 7 will become 6. So 10 minus 6 is 4. Yes, very good children. And 6 minus 5 is 1. So 70 minus 56 is 14. Very good children. So now you already know how to subtract. Yes or no? Yes, very good. Excellent children. And now, if you already know how to subtract, I'm going to give you another problem. It is a mental problem, huh? Okay. Listen very carefully. Adelaida boiled 30 eggs. How many Adelaida boiled? Yes, 30 eggs. She sold 20. So we're going to put the 30 eggs. 30 eggs. These 30 eggs that Adelaida boiled. Adelaida boiled. How many? 30 eggs. So, how many does Adelaida sold? 20 eggs. Very good. 20 eggs. Adelaida sold. So here, how are we going to get the answer? We are going to? Yes, very good. Subtract. So from 30, we are going to? Look. Yes. So 0 minus 0, yes, of course, is already 0. So 3 minus 2, you can answer, very good, is 1. So how many eggs were left? Yes, it's 10 eggs. 10 eggs were left. 10 were left. Oh, you can solve now. The mental problem. Next is... Subtract 100 from 430. Who can answer? Okay, let us put up here. 430 minus 100. Okay, you can answer. Okay. 0 minus 0 is 0. 3 minus 0 is? It's what? It's the same. It's also or three to happen. Why? Because wala may value on zero. Okay. Oh, understand? You get it now? Mm -hmm. It's only three to happen. And then four minus one is what? Four, one of one, pila? Three. Yes. So, for 30 minus 100 is 300. Very very good children. So now you already know the subtraction. You already know subtracting tens and ones of regrouping. So any questions before I leave this class? No? Okay, thank you. You don't have any questions. So I will give you your assignment for today. We're going to answer this at your room. So here's your assignment.
at your assignment and after you're at home, okay? Mm-hmm. You don't have any questions for your assignment? Okay.